And a lot of people are coming at me in my sponsored posts on Twitter saying, you don't use swab, sis. Da -da 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 -da. Like, guys what's goody it's your girl Shanice welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are new here definitely make sure you subscribe to my channel so I thought I would do a product empties video skincare hair care body care everything care related just so you guys can see the products that I've been using and finishing and y'all know if I finish a product if one finishes a product that means they love that shit. So any one of these products that I finish, that means I truly, truly love these products and will probably repurchase it. So with that being said, let's just hop right into it. I got a bunch of products right here, which I'm about to show you. And I guess we can start with the skincare. All right, so first up, I have my Dr. Bronner soap. If y'all watch my body care routine video, I use these bad boys I freaking love them so much so this one is actually the peppermint and this is a 13 fluid ounce bottle so I finished all of this the peppermint I mainly use this for the winter and then this is the the almond this is the almond and they both smell really really good I love this one for like spring and even in the winter, it doesn't really matter, but I love these because they are natural. You can use them for multi, you know, multiple purposes, and they just are so good on the body. So good on the body. So I finished two of these 32 fluid ounce bottles. So next on my skincare is this Claire's Rich Moist Soothing Cream, and this is Korean Beauty. Oh my goodness. This is so, 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 so good. I use this in the winter. I use it even in the spring. There's so many times I use moisturizers and it either it leaves me too greasy, it still leaves me dry. But this right here, it leaves me very, very moisturized without the greasy feeling. So I love, 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 love this. And I'm definitely gonna repurchase. I definitely wanna try out more Korean Beauty because if this is this, if this is that good, I can't imagine what their other products are like. So shout out to Darcy for putting me on. Um, I will link her channel down below. She does a lot of like Korean beauty and she's black. So next up is this Origins Gloom Away Grapefruit Body Buffing Cleanser. So it's like a um, body buffer cleanser type of product. So I use this almost every single day in the shower just to exfoliate my body and leave it nice and smooth. I really like this, it's not harsh on your skin at all. The beads in it are very mild, so you're not gonna feel like it's like scraping your body up. So yeah, and this smells really, really, really good. So I actually really love this. This is my second bottle of this, so your girl love this stuff. So my new favorite body wash is the Love Beauty and Planet Maru Maru Butter and Rose. This right here is heaven sense. And um, I love this so, 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 so much. I finished this bottle, bought a new bottle, and then I even have a bottle at home. And the crazy thing is, is that I was actually sent this um, to do a sponsored post on, and I, I really, 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 really fell in love with this. Like, it's literally my staple product, especially this summer. The smell on this is amazing and it's vegan as well. So vegan, even the bottles are like, I think 90 something percent. Oh, they're hundred percent recycled bottles. So they are doing amazing things for the planet. Like my boyfriend uses this as well. And when he bathes in it, like I could smell him till the next day, even though he puts lotion on, even though he puts his own like scents on. Mm. All right, so my last body care product is this Naturals by Gina B Kiss My Ash Body Bomb. You guys have seen this also in my body care routine. I go through these like it's no tomorrow. I probably use about maybe seven of these by now. They are so, so, so good. Very moisturizing. And I love the way this smells. This is the lavender scent, but woo, woo, woo. Oh my God. Oh my God. It smells so good like I love any type of shea butters body butters any of that on my skin all year round is all I use so definitely highly suggest to check this out I will link it down below but bomb stuff all right so now moving on to hair products I'm gonna show you guys everything that I used up so far first thing being is this suave professionals coconut oil infusion damage repair conditioner so 
this gold bottle right here. And a lot of people are coming at me in my sponsor post on Twitter saying, you don't use swab, sis. Da -da 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 -da. Like, who are you talking to? I've been using swab since I started using a lot of natural hair products, first of all. This was my first like go-to conditioner. My mom still uses the conditioners on my sister's hair. I still use these conditioners because they are everything to me. This is great for detangling, co-washing, everything. I even use it as a leave-in. Like this stuff is so bomb. Next up, we have my favorite styling products. Well, one of my favorite, which is the Texture ID Styling Cream. I use it for all of my wash and goes. Um, and I've been through two of these already. That's how amazing they are. I use it as like the, I think the second product I use before I put a gel in. It definitely is a styler, but it's also very moisturizing. So these things right here, I'm definitely gonna repurchase about two more of these. I actually went to Sally's the other day and they didn't have any, which I was sad about, but these are my babies. These are my, these are my babies. I didn't even show you guys these products, like the Texture ID is done. So another product that I ran out of is the Carol's Daughter Cocoa Cream Coil, Coil Enhancing Moisture Butter. This stuff is so moisturizing and it smells heavenly. Um, I actually really, really love this stuff. I also use it for my wash and goes, but I will also use it for braid outs and twist outs just because it's that moisturizing for my hair. Definitely gives me amazing shine. And I don't really have anything else to say other than that it's really bomb really bomb and I will definitely repurchase. So the next line that I really love is by Shea Moisture. This is my favorite Shea Moisture line that they have. This is the Manuka Honey and Mafuro Oil Intensive Hydration Hair Mask. And then I also have their Intensive Hydration Shampoo. Shampoos to me are honestly just shampoos. Like I can honestly use any shampoo and be happy with it, but I definitely did use up all of this. So that definitely says a lot. Um, compared to most shampoos that I have, this probably has the least amount in it, but I like it. So this is probably the one and only thing in this basket right here that I may or may not repurchase. If I get it like from PR, I would definitely use it up, but other than that, I have so many shampoos. Like, you know, as naturals, we use like a quarter size shampoo and then like a liter of conditioner. But this right here, honey, this is the Intensive Hydration Hair Mask. This is everything to me. It makes my curls come back to life. My hair is popping after this. My curls are popping. My hair is super moisturized. Even my boyfriend uses this and he has a, I think a, I think he has like 4B hair texture and he really, really loves this stuff as well. Sometimes he even uses it as like a little leave-in and it works amazing on his hair. So another Shea Moisture product, this is the Daily Hydration Shampoo with Coconut Milk and something something Senegal. So now that I'm looking at my empties, I think I really just love the Shea Moisture Shampoo. So I'm definitely going to stick with their shampoos and I do love this stuff. I actually love a lot of the products in this line as well because my hair does like coconut. My hair likes a little bit of protein. So yeah, this is finished and it smells amazing. I love the smell of coconut. So. And then the last hair product that I have here is uh, the Camille Rose Naturals Baruti, Baruti Nectar Repair Cholesterol Treatment. Oh my gosh, I do have a deep conditioning video using this. I will link it down below and it'll pop up on the card screen. But this stuff right here is cleared out. Like not even a little drip of anything is in here. Not even a little drip. And this stuff smells amazing, first of all, and it is so moisturizing to my hair. My hair literally ate this thing up and just took all the moisture into my hair strand. So if you're looking for a moisturizing deep conditioner, even though this is really tiny and I probably only got like two uses out of it or two to three uses, definitely highly suggest you to pick this up. Oh, I forgot. So lastly, I have the Diva Curl Ultra Defining Stronghold Gel. If y'all know me, you guys watch all of my tutorials, I use all different products, but I always keep this the same. I, this always remains the same in my wash and goes, usually, if you guys look at my, like my go-to wash and goes. So I use it all the time for every, almost every single wash and go, and I really, really love this stuff. I've probably been through 10 bottles by now. It's amazing, love it, love it, love it. It is a pretty penny, it is kind of expensive, but for me, and my wash and goes is totally worth it because it always 
this thing always makes my wash and goes work so love 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 this stuff and i feel like if you have a hair texture like mine that will definitely do you good so anyways that wraps up all of my product empties if you guys have any more questions or if you guys like these videos definitely give this video a thumbs up and i will definitely do more of them but yeah y'all comment down below any of your favorite products because i definitely want to try out some new products and i will see you guys all in the next video i love you guys deuces There's no